Hello everybody, my name is Lucie Koutková. Welcome to the online application tutorial for international students. Today I will guide you through the process of filling in your application at the Technical University of Liberec. There will be three points on our agenda. Number one is the unique identifier and how to create it. Then the online application itself and then what happens next. Let's have a look at the unique identifier first. Uh, each Czech person has a unique identifier, which is also called birth code. So to submit your application, you need to generate a pseudo birth code, which will serve you as an identifier when you want to manage your applications and see their status. Let's have a look at how it is done. When you go to our web page, www.tul.cz slash en at the left bottom corner you can click on apply now and you will see the application interface there is a set of questions which you need to answer with no so you haven't studied at the Technical University of Liberec yet you are not a Czech citizen and you don't have a birth code officially assigned in the Czech Republic. So here we will create the birth code. You need your a name. I'll use my name. And let's take this date as my birth date. And I'm a female. Now I'll say generate a pseudo birth code and log in. Now I can already start filling in the application. So I choose the faculty. I will work here with the example of the faculty of mechanical engineering, but the same process works for all the faculties. Mechanical engineering. And here, this is very important. Kindly choose English as the language of the program. This will filter all the programs that, and specializations that are offered in English. Here we see that in the academic year 2016-17 we are offering four. I'll work with innovation engineering as an example here. I say choose. And I can start filling in the application. Everywhere there is an asterisk, uh, the information is mandatory. As you can see, there is a type of student category here. Uh, this is meant for agencies. If you're not coming through an agent, you just choose no agency. Next. My name is already filled in. Uh, please fill in as much information as possible. Uh, I'll work with the mandatory fields only here. Citizen of let me take India as an example. Permanent address country, India. District. I will fill in X's here only, but please fill in the correct information. Cell phone. Please make sure that you fill in uh, the correct area code. This is crucial so that we can reach you. So it would be, for example, this for India and your email. It is really important that you actually fill in an email that is um, that you check on a regular basis. Otherwise, you will not receive the information that you need birthplace country again i choose india for example new delhi where is the applicant applying from maybe you're applying for a master program so you choose university so you can see that sometimes there is a bubble on the left side and then some uh, explanation is available previous education let's say bachelor now you need to fill in the university 
There are very few predefined schools, so please enter the name of your university uh, manually. I will go for Amity University as an example. I say choose here. Uh, faculty you studied at in your home country, the study program you studied in your home country, branch of study, thesis title, all the information that you know, and the year of the most recent graduation. If you are to graduate in the year of your application, just fill in that year. So let's say I think that I will graduate in 2016. Then we have the A-levels or secondary uh, certificate uh, graduation year. Let's say I'll put 2013. Again, you have to select school here. Please again Fill in the name of your school manually and choose here. Secondary school branch of study. If you had some specialization at your secondary school, uh, you can fill that in. I say save. And now I already have a summary of the application. Uh, here I can see that my application was registered, my details are, fi are filled in, there is a confirmation of which program I chose, that it's uh, in Liberec, in it's a postgraduate master, full-time study, and uh, the specialization is innovation engineering. You also have your pseudo birth code here. One more time, please make sure to take note of this copy it, write it down, save it, whatever you wish to, because uh, the pseudo birth code and uh, the initials will work as your identifier want to, when you want to come back to your application to check on its progress. What is quite important is that a, an important part of the application is uh, the payment of the application fee. For example, for this program, it's 25 US dollars and all the information you need for the uh, payment is available here at the bottom of the page. Uh, you will receive a confirmation email once you submitted your application. The next important thing you should go do is actually either follow the link in your email or go to the link provided here. And uh, here we have the next steps in the application process. In the case of the mechanical engineering, the following documents must be sent to this address. So confirmation of payment of the application fee, bachelor diploma or provisional certificate, diploma supplement, copy of your passport. And there are some more steps mentioned. For example, the evaluation of your previous education, and some more information about the written entrance examinations. Well, thank you very much for uh, going through the application with me. If you have any questions or doubts, please write to international at, tul, at international at tul .cz. Thank you, and I wish you all the best.